Jumping high and flying even higher, a Lumberton cheer team is putting Southeast Texas on the maps with these stunts and their dance moves. Cheertown USA took home first place at the National Cheerleaders Association Championship earlier this month. 12 News reporter Victoria Dillion caught up with these national champs. Now some people might think cheerleading isn't a sport, but these national champions might just prove you wrong. Five, six, seven, eight. Before the glitter and glam comes hard work. Competition cheer is, it's hectic, it's, it's nerve wracking, it's tears, it's blood, it's sweat, it's everything. Robin Buckholtz has been a cheer coach for almost 40 years. 2013, 14, 18, uh, 13. I mean, we've been to NCA 13 years in a row. And I believe the closest we ever got was second. But on March 1st, Cheertown USA took home first place at the National Cheerleaders Association competition, the biggest cheer competition in the country. Nobody expects a gym like us to go in and win. Grace Harden and Hayden Hawkins say it wasn't easy. This trophy was earned. The week before nationals, we normally practice anywhere from four to five times a week. And we work really hard to get where we want to be. And all of our hard work has paid off. So. For the next few weeks, these cheerleaders will be practicing on perfecting every stunt and jump for a summit competition at Disney that was World. very fast. Do it again. And for those who still don't think cheerleading is a sport. They are wrong. <laughs> I Googled it. <laughs> and it said cheer is a sport. I don't believe in any other sport you run, tumble, jump, throw someone in the air, not a ball, a person, and catch them, and then be able to still dance, and do it all with a smile on your face. Now the team is raising money for their trip to Disney. And to find out how you can help, go to our website, 12newsnow.com. In Lumberton, Victoria DeLeon, 12 News.